Hi, hello everyone. Uh, welcome to my channel, Caterpillar uh, June Help. Please like and subscribe my video. Uh, this video that I would like to little bit explanation. If you are, uh, this video is related on the excavator Comacho. Okay, excavator Comacho. The model is based on my uh, subscriber. He was requested a video how to solve his problem. Uh, he's facing a problem that when they operated the machine, the machine is almost uh, even the pull. Uh, the machine is a uh, full acceleration, is almost stuff or uh, dying. Same like that. Okay, I'm sorry about my English. Huh? I hope uh, everyone will understand about it. Uh, so based on his uh, problem so that is a uh, electrical related <coughs> okay this electrical related there is a solenoid attached attached on the hydraulic pump main hydraulic it is pump. located on the rear side of the engine if you are at the front side of uh, the machine it is in the left side okay If you are in the back side of the machine, it is on the right side. Okay, just open the door at the back side or rear side of the engine. Open, you will find the hydraulic pump. Okay, there is a two hydraulic uh, solenoid there attached on the hydraulic pump. That is what we call a PC and LS bulb. Okay, that both bulb is function to regulate the maximum supply or the maximum pressure of the hydraulic pump okay if that one or if that a pc or ls bulb is no supply or not available supply meaning to say when you operate the machine the machine will be in a load it's a too much load even that is a full acceleration okay it's almost dying that's what we call dying because I don't know exactly how to say about the word the word about that okay now this is uh, in this video I will show you how and where is that solenoid okay just follow and then keep on watching and uh, before of all just uh, please like and subscribe my video uh, this is the follow-up video about uh, the relief bulb I was showing on uh, my first video before so there is one of my subscribe requesting okay keep on watching right now uh, I am here now in the PC 22 PC 220 I think this is so I'm here at the logo of PC 220 this is the cover open it and then this is the hydraulic pump okay this is what i'm mentioning uh, i mentioned about uh, message to you so this is your request video okay bro uh, about the problem of your machine i think that is uh, related on the ls or a ps bulb one of the solenoid, uh, I don't know exactly for now uh, which one is uh, continuously on, but one of the both solenoid will be shut, uh, turn it off when you started to operate the machine, okay? Just to regulate the supply of the this hydraulic pump, to regulate the supply of the hydraulic pump, not to pull pressure for the engine because there is a coming heavy load for the engine. If both of these solenoid is no supply at first starting, the engine must be stuff, almost stuff when you start to operate. So that's all, bro. I think uh, you understand about what I'm uh, telling about in this video. Okay, you have to check it first this solenoid. So don't do any troubleshooting on hydraulic system unless you check this supply. Okay, the supply of both solenoid make it sure that the supply is available or you can use also direct 
you take one wire from the battery supply okay this red wire put one wire direct to the battery direct to the battery both and then you will see the difference uh, maybe uh, uh, you will see the difference compare when the first uh, uh, when the problem uh, persists or uh, is there okay and then also uh, I will uh, mention also in this video you go to the operator's cab the operator's cab okay Okay, this is what I mean TPC lock okay well once they just switch on like that that means the both solenoid will be supplied or started to supply the the electric or uh, the switch up uh, the electric will uh, switch on for that solenoid but there is some switch here uh, at the right side of the operator set okay this is the set okay oh. okay now I will show you at the rear side okay right side rear and right side of the set there is a small cover here and then we have a, one switch I think uh, two switch two switch okay this is the two switch available here make it sure that both switch okay make it sure that this both switch this switch it's a uh, the position is all on down position okay now in position the position is all down because this is also the cut off of the uh, uh, ls and ps bulb okay make it sure that this switch is a uh, put uh the direction is a uh, down direction okay that's all for now if you might not found anything uh, by this video uh, don't hesitate to send a message again and then I will uh, explain to you some problems and then also uh, and then this also the fuse box okay this the fuse box don't hesitate to send a message and, uh, I think uh, your machine and uh, our machine we don't have a 228 model here but I think it's uh, almost same okay we hope this video will uh, help you to find out uh, about the problem you are uh, facing for now but I'm sure I think that is only a hydraulic pump you have to check the supply of that boat so limit okay Again, I will, I will come in. I will return here in the side of the hydraulic pump. Okay. This is the solenoid. Okay. This is solenoid. And also, this is the other one. Okay. Again, must be when you started the engine and then switch up the PPC lock, that both solenoid will switch on. Okay. But when you started to operate the machine or uh, run, for example, run the travel motor, push the travel motor, or up the boom, down, or stick. Any any function of the hydraulic when you start to operate, one of the solenoid will be switched off. Okay, will be switched off because they have a uh, other pressure switch near on the side of the control valve. It's controlling this uh, solenoid valve or PS or LS solenoid valve. Okay, this is an easy way how you can solve the, your problem. You can put you can try to put direct wire, direct color wire of the solenoid, and it's near. Okay, this is the battery box. Okay, this is the battery box. Can uh, bring one small uh, small wire, put to the positive side, 24 volts, and then direct the, the red color wire. Open that uh, rear side of the mod, uh, hydraulic pump. See, this is the battery box. Okay, hope this video will help you, brother.
and then uh, don't hesitate to uh, send a message again okay thanks hope uh, you like this video it's uh, almost the same with your uh, machine okay yeah you see the boom